Hey everyone, welcome to my vlog. Today I wanted to share with you a kind of hidden gem in Budapest that not many tourists know about. Um, so if you're visiting or you're just in Budapest in the summer and didn't already know about this place and you want to kind of escape the hustle and bustle of the city and be surrounded by nature while having kind of a bite to eat and a drink, um, Nepsiget is perfect for you. It only takes 30 minutes to get there by public transport by taking Line 3 in the direction of Ujpest Kuzpunt and getting off at the second last stop. So it's really accessible and only requires one ticket, which costs 450 farant, and that's the equivalent of basically over a euro. So for ease, I suggest putting on Google Maps the name of one of the bars by the river, such as Cabin with a K, which will show you how to get there by metro, and then how to get there walking 10 minutes from the metro stop. As you can see, the walk to the place is really nice. You're surrounded by nature as you walk along the path and the bridge, and you can see people kayaking in the river. Um, so you already feel like you got out of the city. Um, but one thing to note is stay to the side and keep your eyes out as it's very popular with cyclists. Oh, so it's so nice to arrive here. So yeah, um, arriving here, y it, when you arrive here, you'll find yourself in, you know, a really serene environment. Um, and there's four different bars um, to choose from where you can grab a drink and they also offer food. Um, so there's lots of choice. Yeah, and as you walk along to the bars or along the river, you'll start to feel like you've properly left the city as it's really green and lush, as you can see. Um, the bars are all close together, so it's easy to pick whichever one you prefer. Um, cabin uh, is a nice bar, uh, which norm has normal tables and closer to, ri to the river, they also have small little hut type seats, which provide shade from the sun. Um, and they're perfect to sit in for one or two people. Um, and then there's also Vassar Bar and Grill, which is another good option. And then there's also uh, one called Sitakoto. I like the bar Perem, uh, as some of the tables are, you know, they're just really right beside the river and surrounded by trees. So I kind of, whenever I go there, um, that's one of my favorite places because it's just so nice to sit like directly beside the river um, and under the trees and yeah, really feel like you're in nature. The vibe here is so refreshing. Um, it's really a peaceful riverside retreat um, from the city and the area is dotted with lots of trees um, and yeah, there's just a true sense of tranquility. So it's an ideal spot for a picnic, whether you're with friends, family or just a good, a good book on your own. You know, although there are bars here, you can just feel free to like bring your own stuff and sit by the river. Um, there are toilets, so that's the good news. Um, yeah, the sound of the river flowing kind of creates the perfect backdrop for relaxation. And it's also a popular place for dogs to play. So sometimes it's nice to watch the dogs jumping into the water and having fun. If you're planning to visit and want to just chill, I really recommend, if you can, going early in the day, especially from Monday to Friday. Um, during these times, it's nice and relaxing without the evening or weekend crowds. And yeah, like during this time, I really think it's a great place to unwind and, you know, enjoy the fresh air. And as I said, maybe catch up on some reading or have a heartfelt chat with a friend. Um, but if you like it busy, of course, I suggest go coming in the evenings or at the weekend. I actually took this vid video when it was a more busy day. Um, 
And another thing is, if you're a fan of sunsets, you're in, in for a treat because the view here is absolutely stunning as the sun dips below the horizon. I'm kind of finished showing you Nepsiget itself and the main bars, um, but I just wanted to tell you as well that, you know, if you're here and want to kind of really enjoy the your chance to be in nature, there's also like a few, you can kind of walk along the river as I, I did when I was shooting this video. Um, so the greenery and the scenic paths make it a really, really nice spot for a stroll um, before or after you settle down by the river for a drink um, or for your picnic or whatever. So you'll see if you go for a walk through the green paths by the river um, that the, there are also people having barbecues or laying in hamm hammocks a little bit further down. Um, so there are also more secluded places to hang out uh, as well. And that's also an option. If you if you come down here, you can kind of get away from the crowds um, by just walking a little bit further and choosing um, one of the more secluded spots. So basically, if you're in Budapest and looking for a peaceful escape, yeah, I just really highly recommend check checking out this riverside place. Um, it's beautiful. It's a lovely underrated spot um, that's perfect for kind of a relaxing day out or just, you know, a few hours, a few hours to get a break from the city. Um, there's actually lots of places like this that people hang out in summer near Budapest, but this one is particularly accessible, so that's why I wanted to highlight it, especially if you're staying in the center of Budapest, as it only takes 30 minutes to get there. So I just feel that it's great that it's so close to the center. Um, so even if you're only visiting Budapest for a few days, um, I really feel you can kind of squeeze it into your to your schedule, especially if you're the type of person who likes to be surrounded by nature, um, because you can just spend a few hours there and you still have plenty of time to kind of do the main tourist things um, as well. So thank you for watching. I'm going to end it here. As you can see, I'm <laughs> leaving, leaving the area. Um, so I hope you get to enjoy this lovely place as much as I do, uh, if you have the chance. And yeah, of course, as always, remember to like and subscribe um, to my channel and see you the next time.